Hello everyone, this is John here again doing a, a build video for you. Going to build the 132 scale Brushwood Basics single base shed. So, get this going. It says in the instructions that you're going to have this. You're going to have, this is what you have. You have a drill bit, you've got the head screws all that stuff in here so they're saying that they want you to screw the drill the hole here into the wood they say that also you could glue this you could glue this to it and stuff too but I'm not gonna glue it I'm just going to, I'm not gonna drill in the hole either I'm just gonna put the screw right on in it make sure it's level and we'll go from there and see what happens so let's get started on this and see how well it works and get this going right. here's my handy dandy drill so it's saying to use a level a level place to work with. Put this over here. Alright. So we're going to start we're going to start off with the side. We're going to start off with this. And it does come with roofs and the roofs are like detachable. So this this is going to be one side. And you want it to make sure it's flush because it's going to be down. And the other peg. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, I'm going to um, after I get this going, my plan is to maybe after it's all done. Is to go ahead and I'll glue it in the back of it so you, know, you can't so you can't see it, but that's my plan. Just to glue it like that. Okay. So we'll get the screws in there first. Oh, this is a small, smaller bit. Really small bit. So I found out that the screw, the head, is smaller than the bit that I have on mine. So I have to get a totally different, different size. So I'll have to change this out. This one in there. Charge it the right way. Just like that. And let's see here. Just like that. Okay. All right. Let's try this now. So. I'm going to try to get this to go on here. Get easy like. Let's see here in a second. All right, so here we go. Let's get this thing started. We'll go down this part first. Let's make sure see the holes just like that just like that make sure these are flushed to the bottom get these just to do it like this and I'll hold it like that okay so we'll put this like this and away we go I don't want to 
to too, too tight. I don't want it to fall. Okay. This one. Make sure it's in there good. So it says you don't have to drill it in there too tight. You can just, you know, just get it flushed the best you can. That's all you really want. You don't want it to break the break the wood. Oops. It's okay because it's not going to take it out anyway. What you should do is just go in. There. So there's one. Oh, oh, so I see it cracked here a little bit. So probably what I'll do when it's all built, I will probably put a little dab of glue along the edges and stuff so you can see. You can see that. There's a crack. So I'll put glue on the top and then probably along the edge on the inside of it. We'll go from there. All right. Now it's going to be fun. I'll do the wall. This is where it's going to probably going to get interesting. Yeah, this is actually a pretty big, a big shed. But at least it's standing up. So it won't be, it won't be so bad now. Since it's standing on for me. <clears throat> now that I have the table too. More level for me. Oops. Okay. I want it to go that way or this way. Like this. Okay. So here we go. Especially when you're trying to do it all with one hand. But, but like I got this, I bought this from um, Scale Farm, pretty much, where I'm doing a lot of my ordering online. So, I should go check them out. something there you know order from them totally recommend it absolutely recommend it they're over there in the UK but yeah, I hope that this is helpful and in my recording and stuff Hard to do with, that's for sure. That's not too bad. That's not too bad, but we'll get it going here. And Oops. Aha. Uh -huh. Did I do that one right? And 
that's how not to make a mistake. There we go. That's a little better, I think. Get that done there. But yeah, so get this stuff going. We have this little single bay. Single bay shed all built. The tractor to go in here. Along with the, along with the crates of potatoes. That's a pretty good size, pretty good size bay. And this is the single bay. Oops. So this is the this was the single bay that I bought. I figured it would be you know good enough. It'd be good enough for my for my my diorama that I'm building. I didn't need to have a lot of a lot of room really. It's gonna be a small farm. So that side did not go too well. But you know, once I get this on here I'll I'll be able to see what I need to try to fix. What I need to try to fix later on, you know. So So it's a nice little progress we got here going. The bit's not even magnetized, so that doesn't help. Easy to magnetize. That one bit was magnetized, but it's oh, too small, so change out the bit. But yeah, here soon I'll be able to show you a whole new new thing that I've been working on. It'll be the diorama that I've been building. Remember, this is a 132 scale that I've been working on. It's coming along nicely. The my diorama doing getting it's getting there slowly but surely, but it's it's getting there. Yeah, so after I do the video, I'll probably have to do some touch-ups and stuff. And... Oops. Oops. Let's do this. Now let's try it. see now it's kind of hard to see everything up close a 
we'll get that going like that for now. We'll do stuff better later. Okay, this side. Let's open it back up again. Yes, we see. Just get the top part better and then I do the bottom. That's for sure. <laughs> Alright, so <laughs> we're just gonna leave it at that for now. Just get it those screws in there for now. So that is the single bay. So I do think it may have been better to have done this first to get the little holes in there a little bit because you don't want to go too far you know because of the wood on the top you know you're going to go so far with it and it and it tells you to you don't have to go in so far but um yeah so that's the shed and we got some roofs for it I'll show you Let's see, I want the roof. Roof goes like this. Let's go like this. Oops. There. There. And the other one. So this goes like that. It has little slots for it. It'll it's in just like that and there's a little single bay there's the that's how it's gonna look just like that and let's do this let's get the the big old John Deere in here have it drive inside for you guys see how that looks inside that bay Yeah, look at that. Not too bad. How about we do this? We turn some lights on. Get some lights turned on. Get some lights turned off. Yeah, look at that. So that's with the lights on. Yeah. So it's not too bad. I, I like that. So uh, that's my video six build video for the first time. It, it did take longer than I expected. Sorry for that. But um, yeah, check this out. Hope you liked it. Give me some comments on how I did it. <laughs> what you think I should have done differently. Um, subscribe, like, comment. Uh, I'd like to hear from you all. All right, everybody be safe out there. Take care. Bye.